What's up everyone, Reina here and today we're going to talk about Iran's most famous handicraft, the authentic Persian carpet. We're gonna tell you the five things you should consider when choosing your carpet or kilim. Remember, Persian carpets are an investment that can last generations. So take your time when making your choice. Also, if you haven't subscribed us already, do it now. I mean, right now. Are you ready? Let's go. Okay guys, so the first point to consider is color. More specifically, synthetic versus natural. In general, it is always better to buy carpets and creams with natural dyes since they are a better investment. Carpets and creams with natural dyes usually comes with a certificate of authenticity. Official dealers and makers will always guarantee their merchandise. The second important factor to consider when buying a new carpet is the knot count. In general, the higher the knot count, the finer and the more expensive the carpet is. Nomadic carpets like this start at three knots per square centimeters, while the city carpets come in a variety of different knot counts. For example, this one starts at 40 knots per square centimeters, this one from 60 knots per square centimeters, and of course this one started from 100 knots per square centimeters. Usually this one, which it is 3 knots per square centimeters, take one person almost two months to weave, while the other one, which is 100 knots per square centimeters, take the same person two years or even more. The third point to consider when buying a new carpet is the material. I'm gonna show you the different combination of materials that we are using in Iran from the least expensive to the most expensive one. So the first one is the combination of cotton and wool and then the second one is 100% pure wool. The third one is the combination of wool and silk and the last one which it is the fourth kind is 100% pure silk. Within the category of silk carpet the city carpet again have higher knot counts than their nomadic counterpart. The fourth important point to consider is the size. Basically, the larger the carpet is, the longer it takes to weave, the more expensive it becomes. Although every corner of Iran has its own standards when it comes to size, generally they start at this baby size of 30 by 40 centimeters and the sizes can include 60 by 90 centimeters 120 by 80 centimeters 1 by 1.5 meters 2 by 1.4 meters and can go up from there remember depending on the material a carpet that's this size might be the same price as the carpet that's this size and finally, the fifth point to consider is the design. Basically, there are two categories, nomadic design and city design. While city designs are based on established patterns, the nomadic design usually comes from the mind and the heart of the weaver. Of course, there are some specialty carpets like this magic double-sided carpet here. Other specialty carpets include antiques, like this unique 100-year-old carpet, and ones with extremely unique colors, designs, and knot counts. So guys, these were five points to consider when buying a Persian carpet. Hope you guys are now more familiar with Persian carpets. If you have any questions, let us know and we will see you in the next one.